Bill, I think we're dying from cuteness overload over here. <laughs> But first, we're going to get ready for all that jazz. This is the longest-running American musical in Broadway, coming to the Starlight stage this weekend. So excited, because joining us are two of the leads of Chicago, Angel Rita and Peter Lockyer. Angel, you are homegrown. You are back <laughs> on the Kansas City stage, and you've actually performed at Starlight many times. Yeah, I think this is like my seventh maybe seven or eighth time at this point, but uh, my first show was when I was nine years old. I did Brigadoon. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so crazy. But I went to the um, Starlight Theater yesterday and saw the space and was still wowed mm -hmm. by how amazing it is and how big and beautiful it is. It's, it's amazing. And I think we're going to take a look at some of the different photos that have been captured of you oh, playing so many different yes. roles yeah. in That's Chicago. Right there. There. <laughs> so what's it been like playing a whole list of characters in this musical that you love? You're really a veteran. Well, you know, it was the first job I got out of um, college, the first national tour. And I was 21, and it's like, what do you do when you get your dream show right out of school? You know, I was thinking mm -hmm. it would take me forever to book a job, you know? And I had no idea that I would go on to play every woman character in the show. It's, it's, a, it's such a gift, and um, I'm, I'm really grateful for it. And Roxy is, I think, my favorite. <laughs> and you're Roxy right now? Yeah, right now, yeah. Okay, so why is that your favorite? Oh, just her journey as an actress. It's just so fulfilling to start in one place. Well, she kind of ends... Mm, her journey is, she doesn't change more, there's only one character that I think changes, but just her journey takes her on so many wild adventures. I think that's why I love it so much. And you're great at it. Oh, stop. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's move over to Peter over there, uh, the other guy on the couch here. So, you've been to Kansas City before. Yes. What was your experience like there, <laughs> and are you happy to be back? Uh, so, I was here in 2000, I'm guessing 13, it could be 12, but uh, I played Valjean in the Les Mis tour uh, at the Music Hall, and I absolutely loved it here. It was a great venue. The audiences were crazy great, um, so I expect them to be crazy great at the Starlight, and I'm thrilled to be at the Starlight. I mean, the Starlight. I, it, it was beautiful. We teched last night and being out under the stars and under the starlight. Now I just realized why it's named the Starlight Theater. Mm -hmm. Duh. Um, <laughs> but uh, but come out. It's beautiful. I can't wait to uh, can't wait to do the show there tonight. Yeah. And tell us a little bit about your character. You are one of the slickest attorneys maybe in the world. That's right. Uh, <laughs> Billy Flynn. Uh, I get to play a slick criminal lawyer. Something I've never been able to play before. And and this is a it's it's a great opportunity. For me to for me to be a guy that's kind of uh, just laser focus on getting his clients off. The, the show opens with this great line that it's uh, it's a story of murder, corruption, greed, adultery, treachery, violence, all those things we hold near and dear to our heart. And that's Billy Flynn. He holds all of those things near and dear to his heart, and that's what he's focused on: getting his clients off and creating celebrity around them. So yeah, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. And we were talking off camera. This is your first role in Chicago. Was that sort of a goal as your career? No, I mean, I, I just, I never, I never expected to do this show. It, it just kind of came out of the blue and audition uh, just uh, uh, came out of the blue. I went in one day uh, for, for our director, Walter Bobby, and, and the next day I heard I was going to be doing the show. So I'm, I'm really excited to do it and uh, uh, be with people like Angel, who is uh, such a vet of the show, and, and she's helped me so much oh, learning the show oh, and be, and, and <laughs> no, you really have, and it's, it's been a great experience to be with this cast that's phenomenal. We have a great uh, uh, creative team, and it's just, it's, it's an excellent show, and, and my, it's been a pleasure to watch all the dancing and everything, so come on out and, and see it. Well, yeah. I've already heard a lot of people are coming to the shows this weekend. Um, do you have anyone special real fast before we go? Mom mm. and Dad who are coming? Well, uh, Fiance is flying in because we're getting married next week here in town. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, but everyone's going to be out. I've got all the family, parents, uh, cousins. You know, it's going to be amazing. My dance studio, Miller Marley, all those kids are coming. Oh. I just, yeah, I'm... I'm over the moon. It's so we're probably going to see a lot of little children there who are yelling <laughs> angel maybe from the seating. I can't wait. Uh, thank you so much, Peter and Angel, for coming out. Chicago is on stage at the beautiful Starlight Theater tonight, tomorrow, and Sunday. That curtain goes up at 8. For ticket information, call 816 
363-7827 or go online to kcstarlight.com.